Now look at the most stupidest thing that you will have ever seen in your entire life. Skitterbeam49 making 12 creatures. How about new? Oh, you have a counter spell. Gosh darn it. <laughs> Gosh darn it. <laughs> Brothers and sisters, and welcome to MTG Malone with me, Max Malone. Thank you so very freaking much for tuning in. No, today's title is not like you know, clickbait or whatever. There is one card I really, really want to get banned because it's just absolutely broken and it uh, should not be in standard, in my opinion. Because you know, it's so good that people are actually playing it in Legacy and in other timeless formats as well. So, and if a card gets to that point that it is so insanely busted. Maybe wizards, maybe think about not putting it into standard because it just gets out of hand so darn real freaking quick. But before we get into that, we're on our way to 3,333, so if you haven't done so already, subscribe to the channel just like the dog. Why, why are you always coming in here looking at me that you're just leaving? <laughs> just like a dad looking into your room and closing the door again like... Why do dads do that? Well, why did they do it? I don't know. I don't know. But enough with the hammering. Let's get into the bandits, please. Hammering. I'm, of course, talking about Simulacrum Synthesizer. This card is absolutely insane. Yes, yes. You could run artifact removal in your main deck always, forever. But do you really want to do this? I mean, most, like, controly kind of decks. Yeah, we'll play Brotherhood's End. But, you know... It's just insane. It is just insane. Um, you have Simulacrum Synthesizer. You can copy it with the three steps ahead. So in the worst case, you could have seven Simulacrum Synthesizers. And then you have cards like the Thrawn Spider that will ramp you in your artifact deck, make you a little uh, little golem here, a construct. I, I would call it a golem. Uh, it's a car instruct, as people like to say. Uh, you have this. Then you play the next turn, the Might and the Weak Stone. Draw two cards, make yourself more of those. Then you play the Skitter Beam Battalion. And you get six creatures out of this. For every single synthesizer that you have, you will get an additional three creatures. Because this makes copies of itself. Those copies enter the battlefield and they will trigger the synthesizer. So if you have, let's say, two synthesizers out, you play this, you get nine creatures for five mana. And they're all ginormous. gy freaking enormous And that is just insanity. Because every creature is as big as every artifact you have. So if you have only two synthesizers and two creatures, that is already 4-4s. Four now add another 12. Now every single creature that you have is a 16-16. For 5 mana. You get 12... Uh, you get... Uh, what did I say? 12 of them. Why is that a thing? I literally hate this. And I'm showing you how busted it is. Because it should not be a freaking thing. Yes, of course, there is always situations where you still lose the game or whatever. But in the most times, hey, you do this and it's GG. You add something like, I don't know, um, not the Brothers and the other one, where you can give all of the creatures haste. Even more GG, you know? Just, what, what are they even supposed to do? What are they even supposed to do? If they don't have a board wipe like 10, 12, 15 times in a row, they just lose the freaking game. If they don't have a way to remove all of your synthesizers, yes, it happens. There is decks that are running Brotherhoods and that are doing it. There is decks that are running the March, but that will be uh, not in standard anymore. Uh, so, yeah. Go ahead, good luck with this. What is the rest of the deck? Well, hardcore control. Uh, apart from the creatures, we have all the control. We have Fading Hope to get rid of their stuff. We have Burn Down the House to get rid of their stuff. We have Brotherhood's End, Fires of Victory, Ill-Timed Explosion, The Might and the Weak Stone, all of that. Even the Cityscape Leather, that can even destroy their stuff. So it's absolutely freaking insane. And the Cityscape Leveler is super nice with the Ill-Timed Explosion because you can just draw it. Discard it, deal 8 damage to all creatures. If your creatures are bigger than 8, you don't even care. And they will easily be bigger than 8. Easily. This card should at be, least be legendary. That it is not legendary is the most stupidest, ridiculous thing that I have ever seen. When it enters, you even scry too. And these 
always come in pairs. You will see in my game, these always come in pairs. So they will always be at least two or three, if not even four because you have three steps ahead. So with this deck, copying this, you know, easy peasy lemon freaking squeeze. So yeah, that is all I have to say. And remember that the Mirex tokens also are artifacts. So you can grow them even freaking bigger every single freaking turn. Fumori Vault, of course, super darn nice in here. And the rest is just lands. We also have two Restless Spires, but actually you don't really need them. All you need is a Simulacrum Synthesizer and a Skitter Beam Battalion. So you can play this turn three, you know. Then you play another one on turn four. Then on turn five, you play the Skitter Beam Battalion. Make yourself freaking nine creatures for five mana. Why the heck not? Why the heck not? It, it's just the way it's supposed to be. And all of these creatures will be ginormous, apart from the Skitter Beam. I'm sorry. Skitter Beam will not be ginormous, but the other ones, absolutely freaking ginormous. So yeah, this is the deck. It's absolutely disgusting. And you cannot tell me that it's not. You just, you can't come down in the comments and say, oh, this is so click, but no, it's not. I, I literally want this card to be banned. And it should be banned. Everybody thinks so. Nobody thinks this card is okay. Everybody that I talked to was like, yeah, this card is insane. It should not exist. And I stand. I stand with that sentiment. This card should not exist. But hey, we're there fun. So enjoy the deck and play it as long as it's not banned. I'm Max Malone and I will see you in those banworthy games. Ravgen's Mastro Pipino! Hey! Oh my lord, Krimmers! Yes, Krimmers! We have the Fading Hope, I would keep this. I almost just skipped a turn. <laughs> almost. Almost just skipped the turn. Alright, all we need is one land to be super happy. We do find one land, we win. Thank you very much, game. We just won the game. Literally just won the game. Yeah, I want both of them in that order even. Both of them in that order. We just won the game. Isn't it beautiful? Yes, it is beautiful. We won the game. I'm telling you, this card is absolutely broken and it should not exist. I prefer the bird to this a million times. A million times. Okay. Can we just look at the deck that was exactly this uh, in my deck list? <laughs> That's kind of wild. Kind of wild. <sighs> so returning this is stupid because it just has, you know, just has like flash. So what good would it do me? But I might be returning the Thrawn Spider. Or, hear me out, just destroy the Kutzil's Flanker. Man. Simulacrum Synthesizer literally, literally should not exist. So it looks like they do have another one. Which is fine with me. We're on five, six, seven, eight. If we draw one more land, we can have like tripled skitter beam and we win. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Every single skitter beam, by the way, also makes a simulacrum synthesizer token. So, even if they have an answer here, go ahead. Do your worst, Mastro Pipino. Do your worst. Do your freaking worst. If you don't have a farewell, you just lost. Oh no, not the Archangel of Wrath, please don't. You could have shot the- oh no, you couldn't have shot this. Easiest game of my life. Wait! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, it's only eight. We're doing it like this. And then we still win. Look, this is- why does it not say non-token or something like that, you know? Why doesn't it say that? Why is this deck so stupid? Why is this deck so stupid? No, I hate the deck. <laughs> Why is it so stupid?
Yeah, simulacrum should just not exist. It's so easily triggered, so easily. If we draw one land, we, we just win. We're on a draw, so let's try. Okay, I think we just won the game. Unless they are the discard deck, then we might have a bad time. Then we might have a bad time. Liliana Vess. Never heard of her. Just don't. Oh, wait, what? We did win? Is that what you're saying? They threw away a Jace. But they don't have a blue source? Is that what is up? <laughs> we all have things we'd rather. All right. Memory Deluge is nice here. It's Memory Deluge first. Easy game. <laughs> Easy game. Easy freaking game. Uh, getting rid of this one. Even though we might need it later, but right now we don't. So if they want to give up their Liliana, absolutely fine with me. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> Yo, Thor and Thank you for the follow! Like, they will ulti the Liliana now and make me choose. What? Okay. Alright. If they do have a Wandering Emperor here, we just counter it. So easy life, easy wife. Kind of the wrong decision here. Oh yeah, that is why I should have kept the rat source. Sorry in the Murphalers. Uh, may I ask you what's the reason someone play alchemy instead of standard? I don't know. I mean, there's a million reasons for that. Oh, look! Three wandering emperors. But look, three simulacrum synthesizers. So, yeah. We need that one. Some people just like it. I don't understand either, but some people just like it. So next turn, next turn, we will make nine skitter beams. Oh no, we won't because um, we still have to play this. Uh, nine tokens with the skitter beam. Just came back since Dominaria. Welcome back, my friend. I don't think I need this. Welcome back, my friend. Like, alchemy is just like... I mean, look at this. This is so stupid. <laughs> Yo! Brick Slayer! Alchemy is, um... Just another format, you know? One goes here, one goes here. Make your choice which Planeswalker you want to protect. Next turn, we just make ourselves nine tokens with the Skitter Beam Battalion. Absolutely insane. Absolutely insane. And every single token, every single token will become like a 15-15 or something like that. I really don't care. <laughs> you know why? Because I still have the Skitter Beam freaking battalion. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You know what? I will be greedy here. I will be greedy for one turn, just to prove a point. Just to freaking prove a point. Like, alchemy is like, uh, only cards that are, like, all the standard cards. Plus some, yeah, rebalanced cards and stuff like that. But it's like, not good enough. 
Rita Malone is the best. Malone, thanks. I, I think so as well. Give me all the monies. Okay. So you're telling me they lost. We must now look at the most stupidest thing that you will have ever seen in your entire life. Skitterbeam49 making 12 creatures. Oh, you have a counter spell. Gosh darn it. <laughs> Gosh darn it. <laughs> And here I was, ready, but I got outplayed, yes. <laughs> nah, gosh darn it. But hey, we still have a lot of cards to play with, you know, so. <laughs> I kind of should have seen that coming. Kind of should have seen that coming, not gonna lie, but I didn't. Didn't smell it from a mile away. So, what you got here? Well, well, what is this card? It's Jace. Okay. So you're willing to give up your whole board. Ah, ah, ah. Boom. It doesn't even matter that they countered it. It doesn't even matter. Not a single bit. Not a single bit. Get out of here. We're up against Jetien. Getien? Getien? Also, we never not have a synthesizer, so pretty good. Oh, come on. How many more of these are running rampant today? How many freaking more? Let's hope they don't have a legendary creature. If they do, so be it. Nah. <laughs> they kind of have to take the Brotherhood's end, though. Kind of have to take it. You know? Double bat. It's the battle of the bats. It's the battle. Do you think they have another one? Well, we will find out all together, won't we? All right, Vatmir is a little late. All right, it. Ill timed explosion is super nice here. We'll do it like this just in case they mill me. And then I can even discard one of them. I hope they mill me. I hope they mill me hard. I hope they mill me. Why did they do this? What was. What? 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 Oh my god. <laughs> you baboon. <laughs> you absolute baboon. Why did you do that? Why did you do that? Okay, so we're doing this now. Why did they do that? Just, just tapping a swamp? For what? What was the reasoning behind that? I'm so thoroughly freaking confused, man. So thoroughly freaking confused. This drawing two cards, by the way, I must say, Might and Weakstone? Flavor-wise, one of my favorite cards. That you can turn Urza into a Planeswalker with that is just absolutely amazing. Shweldred. Let's return that to their hand. And um, counter it next turn. Like, if you know anything about the lore, it's just absolutely amazing. Just absolutely amazing. A Rise of the Vermin's deck? No. Such a fun budget deck that counters aggro quite well? I mean, hey, budget decks are always like, you know, kind of hard to pull off. I also don't look at rarity of the cards when I'm building decks, unless I don't have the wild cards. But uh, yeah. I have a deck that has win condition of duping Urza. What does duping mean? Are you still here, my friend? Are you sad now? A 
I think this is better. I think this is just better. And I was correct. It was the right decision. Oh no, I'm so stupid. I, I'm literally so stupid. <laughs> I am literally so stupid sometimes. So incredibly stupid. Yo, Zep Schnauzer, thank you for the follow. So incredibly stupid. Helm of Host, oh, duplicate. Do I play Elden Ring? No. I never tried. Malone is incredible, thanks. TikTok, my friend. TikTok. We'll be getting rid of this Brotherhood's End because, like, I need. Like, why did I put this on top? Like, while this was on the stack, I put this on top. Like, I. But I told you. Even misplaying with this deck, it doesn't matter. It literally doesn't matter. Just doesn't. Okay, it's time to give him a little snoozer here. Just putting some pressure onto Getien04. Pass to attacks. Are you tapping your one mana before attacking? No? Okay. Let's discard this Field of Ruin. We have enough land. And looking at five cards is pretty good. Um, yeah, I mean, <laughs> let's make even more copies, shall we? Shall we make even more copies? Yes, we shall! Okay, all right. So, we were cooking here, like three steps ahead. The absolute most busted card in this deck. Absolutely by far. Is this, by the way, a Fumori? Is this one of them? Oh, yeah, I want to do it like this. Is this one of these Fumori? So I think we just won the game here. Because I never realized that there was some sort of alien being like extruded here, you know? Jesus Christ, Simulacrum Synthesizer, you're such a stupid card. Just this video will prove that this card should not exist. Just should not exist. You can do whatever with the deck, as long as you have a Simulacrum Synthesizer on your board. Hey, whatever, you know? Whatever. Get out of here. You know, maybe not everybody has realized that I'm also streaming now since half a year, so I'm okay. Take your time. <gasps> Grimus! Yes, Grimus! Schnauzer? No, Schnauzer is like, um, first of all, it's like a, a, a mustache. Es ist der Bart. <laughs> Why did I say Bart like English? El Barto indeed. Are you ready for a bet to come down? I am. I know I am. Just ready for the bet. Like what is with mono black aggro today? Is it mono black aggro day? Did I miss a memo? Yo, is it mono black aggro day? It is? Why didn't you tell me so? Well, it doesn't matter. This deck is just blatantly insanely good against everything. But also, all of our opponents are, like, slow playing like freaking heck. Okay, let's wait one turn here. If they want to play, like, a Liliana or something. Oh, they're finally here. I don't want that to happen. Okay, Thrawn Speeder. El Barto. Do you remember when Homer was like, I have my own alias now. El Homo. And somebody was like, oh, that's so so uh, good of you that you're coming out. And he was like, oh, no, 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 no. no. <laughs> I love that so much. It was kind of funny. Okay. All right. I hope it was worth it. Double verge of persistence. Interesting. And we're missing lands. Okay. All right. Where I'm from in Germany? Secret. But born and raised in, uh, in Saarland. Alrighty, synthesizer time! I need to land, actually. I can do this all day long, baby. All day long. Next turn, I'm just going to copy this. Yeah, 
They have seven mana though now, which is kind of annoying. But what good will it do them, you know? Will I copy it? Ooh, interesting. I can still counter it, right? Blood letter. Okay. So let us see if we can win this. B4 is putting in a lot of work here. Uh, I need to put this one on top, but I want to keep them all. Oh, you actually do have a removal. Okay, all right. Okay, all right. So yes, they can do this, but I can just re destroy one of them. I can do this over and over again also. How many more of those do you have? Why did you not play this? Why? Yo, Rind Eastwood! Oh, they have another freaking... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, come on. You cannot make this up anymore at this point. How do they have this again? Liliana! Enough with the mysteries. I drop it. I drop it. Two, four, six, seven. Perfect. So they play this now, I play this. And then what? And then what? Did I count correctly? I did count correctly. I'm so proud of myself. So incredibly proud of myself. Beautiful. Beautiful. Absolutely disgustingly beautiful. There you go. There you go. What is there left to say? What is there even left to say? Does anybody need more proof that Simulacrum Synthesizer is the most broken card? Oh, you do? Well, stay tuned. I am sure you can say bollocks. Well, I will say that then. <gasps> Krimus! Yes, Krimus! Look at his broken hand. And I don't mean like a broken hand, you know? No, oh, duress is the only thing that can save you. Phyrexian! And the fires of Phyrexia! Okay, if we draw one land, we win. Because we can make a million synthesizers. So people have been asking for a full version of Fires of Phyrexia. But have you ever seen the Normal version. The one minute version. We will check it out later. Canker Bloom. Look. The perfect answer to our deck has been found. Didn't take him too long. Didn't even take him too long. So we need a removal for this Canker Bloom before we can do anything. Gix. Yeah, that ain't gonna happen. Wait. It is gonna happen. It is gonna happen. But I do have two now, so hey oh, let's go! And maybe I even find, like, an answer here. No, no answer has been found in the making of this video. All right. Thing is that I have two of them now. And maybe even more. I wish I could keep this. But I'm going to keep this. Because I'm just going to make one copy after another. And then, shabwam, we win. Haven't seen a short version? We will check it out right afterwards. Like... Oh, this is just enchantment. Okay. This is just enchantment. If they play something here, I'm okay with that. Actually freaking okay with that. It might be canker blooming now. Not even doing it. Okay. Now I'm sad. Have I tried cryptic code and keys to the vault? Not yet. 
In this deck, at least. Two... Are we dead? So the only thing that could stop us... Was a canker bloom. The only thing that could stop us until now... Was the most disgusting name there is for a card. Canker Bloom. I love it. I actually am happy about that. Because the card is even more than disgusting. Than the freaking Simulacrum Synthesizer. Canker Bloom. Just repeat after me. Canker Bloom. <laughs> Get out of here, game. Come on, we're up against the car? What is this, Street Fighter? You know, because they, like, you can... Fight a car in Street Fighter? Ah, uh, leave me alone. <laughs> leave me alone, I'm old. I'm old. <laughs> I What? Only Malone doesn't know Tool? What? Whoever said I don't know Tool? Whoever said that? You're wrong. And you should feel bad for saying something like that about me. You totally should feel bad. Okay, alright. So we're up against the horse deck, you know, Calamity Horse, that one, yeah, let's get rid of you here because um, it's getting out of hand way too quick. You destroy a car stage, yeah, right? Like what, what if, like whoever thought about doing something like that, whoever was like, you know what would be very, very cool? If people would fight a car. <laughs> I never got that. Never got that. Spinewood armadillo. Armament and a dillo at the same time. Yeah, exactly like in Street Fighter. Look, that is us. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Let's just hope they don't find another land here. Let's just hope they don't find another land here. So they do have the card in hand, which is more than annoying for us. But it all comes down to what else they have in hand. Is it a Vault Born Tyrant? Is it a, um... What, what are you doing here? I'm not talking to you! <laughs> oh, this is exactly what I didn't want to see! The freaking Terror of the Peaks! I'm not... Get out of here! <laughs> ah, dog! Don't do that! Why did they not give it? Oh my gosh. Why did they not give it hexproof? So let us see if they have more of these. If they have another one, you know? Would I be surprised? Not at all. Terror of the pigs? I love you. <laughs> I love you. Come on. Jesus Christ game. Jesus Christ game. How are you doing this? How are you giving my opponents the easiest battles of the freaking... Sounds like we need some Selesnia cure. You're banned. You're banned. <laughs> You're banned. Now and forever. Oh, they're bad at the game. They are bad at the game. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. They're just bad at the game. The next turn we play this. And maybe we win? Question mark? No blocks. I'd rather win next turn. Okay, winning is easy. They could have beaten me here, you know, easily. Freaking easily. But hey, but hey, 
Looks like I am stronger than a car. Hadouken! I am sorry, I just am a huge Street Fighter fan, as you might see here. Right there, look! It's right there, Street Fighter! Hadouken! We're up against Conan the Barbarian! Rimmers! Yes! One lander? Yes! I'm not talking to you, okay? <gasps> this is way better. Okay, alright. Thunder claps. I want that, thank you. Alright, like the amount of same stuff that we're looking at is crazy. I need my Thrawn Spider out. Oh, I mean, hey. This is also pretty darn nice. <laughs> pretty darn nice. So let's just play this for now. They will be so fuming right now. So much fuming. Because they're like, I did not see that in your hand before. What's even going on here? Graveyard Trespasser. See if I care. Like, literally see if I care about your stupid Graveyard Trespasser. That is so the worst card you could have played here. Literally the worst. Boom. Boom. My favorite board game? Oh, I would have to say Terraforming Mars. Like, Terraforming Mars will forever, forever be one of... You know about my hand! You baboon! Will forever be one of my favorite games ever. Like, literally forever. It's just so good. It is just so good. Why do you play Mono Black? Why do you put a bad name on my favorite color? Why are you... I'm fuming right now! I'm fuming at your misplaced opponent! Ah, I, I don't know how to fume. Get out of here! We're up against Shivas! <gasps> Krimus! Yes, Krimus! We're going first a lot! Your son asked how I was able to create the avatar. Hey, first off, welcome, Olaf's son. Welcome to the stream. Second of all, magic. <laughs> magic. <laughs> uh. Thunderclaps. I don't need another one. But is the music way too loud? No, it's not. By the way, I started watching Stranger Things. Yes, 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 I'm like seven years too late, but I started watching Strange. Well, we did start, and we like it. We watched the first season in like three days. Ah. Oh. Tick tock, my friend. Tick freaking tock. There is no need to be this slow. Like, literally no need whatsoever. It's a really good show, yes. It's a good to show. <laughs> what was that again? What was the it's a good to show thing again? I forgot. I forgot. Okay, we have three steps ahead here. Dog! Up. Yay! Ah! Ah! You're licking my ball. My eyeball. Ah! My ear. Ah! Ah! Look at his little cute, cute little back. Oh my god. You're, no, just, don't, don't sneeze in my ear though. That's, that's taking it a little far. I... <laughs> of course he's happy. He's with me. Okay, I try to play magic at the same time. It's a little bit hard. But it's... Maybe if I come over to this side. Okay, perfect. Perfect. Oh, doggo mine. Oh, this... Oh, watch out. Okay. I decided that I want to order, order burgers. Oh, I love you so much. The dogs are way too smart for their own They're way too smart for their own sake? What is that supposed to mean? They drag me down the street. I don't want to play, and then I remember to fight with this girl dog. And they, oh. to see, and they just wanted to see where, where she went and where she's at. Oh, that's kind of cute. Why is it scary? Uh, But also, if they run away, they know how to get home. Why don't we talk in German? Because we respect our viewers. 
That is why. Because it would sound like very ugly. And very angry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like we would want to hurt you. <laughs> That's just wrong. <laughs> Expel the interlopers who even plays this card. Is this a budget deck? Not every cliche. What? Not every cliche is wrong. That's true. That's true. Most of them are, though. That's that's also wrong. Okay. Deadly cover up. That is another three damage to your face. What are you getting rid of, though, my friend? First off, you lost all of your graveyard. Second of all, if you're attacking anyone else these restless reefs, I will just destroy it. Like, just imagine, okay? Just imagine. You're watching the video or you're watching my stream. And all of a sudden you would just hear us speak German. Wouldn't that be like super weird? I say yes. <laughs> no German speaks like that, okay? <laughs> There you go, chat. That, that is what you get for asking stupid questions. <laughs> uh, man. <laughs> chat is going crazy. And I love it. Okay. No more distractions. So we will be doing this now. Now get out of here now, okay? <laughs> this is no Rammstein concert. Rammstein. Um, I think I want this more than anything else. Is this Planeswalkers? It is Planeswalkers. That's beautiful. So. I have hairs in my face. Du. Du hast. Wait, maybe I should do this first. Is the Mother Mother concert? Maybe one day it is. Maybe one day we will be live on this channel. I don't think it will ever happen. But who knows? Who literally knows? What flows from the nose does not go on your clothes. That was kind of stupid by the opponent, not gonna lie. Unless they have like a two man. Oh, they have a no more lies in end. Maybe. Maybe they do have a no more lies. No, they don't. Okay, no more, no more lies. Uh, I don't need this fading hope, to be honest. No more, no more lies. One day. One day I will, my friends. One day I will. Stream a mother concert, maybe. Who knows? Okay, so. Um, I'm passing a turn here. One, two, three, four, five, six. I can do both. So I can counter something and copy the synthesizer. Which is pretty darn good. They're just a mill deck. I don't care about the mill deck. Ashiok, your beloved. Ashiok is pretty darn tasty, not gonna lie. I mean, there is a reason I have this back there. I don't know if you can see it completely, but there is a reason I have this back there, okay? It's because I freaking love Ashiok. Favorite planeswalker by far. By freaking far. Okay, alright. Are you attacking in? What? Like, why are they not attacking in? Like, there's literally no reason not to attack in. Not, not to attack. Not, not to attack in. Oh, you have a counter spell in hand. They do have a counter spell in hand. I don't like that, but that's mana well spent. What are you doing? Oh, they have their own three steps ahead in hand. Okay, all right. That's still fine with me. They spend all of their mana to do that. And I still have a lot of things to do. And if they are not a farewell enjoyer, well then they will not enjoy what I am doing next. I will literally just draw cards here. 
Perfect. And once more, if they're not a farewell enjoyer, you're kind of screwed. So, next turn we might win. Okay. So maybe they survive one more turn. Yo, Magic Reiki, thank you for the follow. So they bought themselves one more turn, eh? They will lose their Ashiok, so... A good eye to you, sir. The I said good eye. If their last card is not exactly another three steps ahead. Like, what is even in here? Nothing. What is in here? Nothing. Okay. Their last card is not exactly three steps ahead. They will be very sad. Are they destroying my Fumori Vault? They shouldn't. Don't destroy another man's Fumori Vault. Don't do that. Just don't. <laughs> your wife got your shirt that says you lose, good taster. <laughs> That's amazing. Nice. Thank you. I agree. I wholeheartedly agree. That this was nice. Whole freaking heartedly. Was that really worth it? Was that really worth it, dude? Like, seriously, was that worth it? I disagree. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, they do have a lot of lands now. And they do have a lot of Field of Ruins now as well. Which is kind of annoying, but as we like to say here on Empty Gym Alone, it's not the end of the world annoying. Don't they lose like this? One, two, three, four, five. They cannot even play like a sun, uh, like a farewell here. Two, four, five. Yeah, and if they like just want to block with this, I mean, I don't really care, you know? They need a lot to make this happen. Do you think the Might Stone Urza Meld is playable in standard or not so much? I think if you are, like, building a deck around it, absolutely playable. Absolutely playable. Like, not even a contest. Okay, let me see what they're playing here. What was the cards that you got yourself? If they feel of ruining my Fumori Vault, do I care? The answer is no. No, I do not care. Okay, so they did find, like, some sort of removal. Do I care? No. <laughs> Once more, I do not care. I do not care. Not in the slightest, my friend. Oh, what were you asking? Oh, do you think... Oh, you got an ad just as I... That is terrible. I'm sorry for that. <laughs> I said... I don't think... I think that actually, yes. I think actually, yes. It's a good card if you build your deck around it. So, if you build your deck around it, absolutely worth it. But getting rid of my Fumori Vol, it still triggers, brah. It still triggers. So, eh? So, eh. Let's get another Red Source because it doesn't even matter. Does not even freaking matter. Um, yeah, let's get the Thrawn Spider because this is the legacy of the Thrawn. Okay. All right. Oh my God, this is so disgusting. This deck is just disgusting. This deck is just disgusting. Do I care? No. Literally couldn't care less. Like, look at my board. Look at it. <laughs> okay. All right, game. Yeah, go ahead and do more of this. Just, just do more of this. Just even more. And more, and more. Even if they have a, like, a farewell now, do I care? No. I will just fading hope my spider and just start the whole party over and over again. Like, what are they even supposed to do? I built this deck, Malone is playing it right now, just as black, white with a uh, blue, white with a... Remember, B is black, U is blue, because that's just how they... That is why you get Wooberg.
That is how you get Wooberg. Oh no, please don't. Whatever will I do? This game is over, Shivas. This game is over. Don't you worry, don't need to be sorry for that. Like, what? <laughs> no need to be sorry because of that. Okay, alright. That is... That is just amazing, my friend. Yes, there was a fourth synthesizer on top. There was a fourth one. Good game. Good game. Good game. Good game. I told you the deck is absolutely broken. And tomorrow, we will be ranking all the way to Mythic with this deck. Doing nothing else. If you saw this video, it will be like some days ago. But if you're here during the live stream, good die to you. Good die to you.